Jam 2012, and we're at the uh, Lisa's booth, and uh, we're standing here with Felix Pacheco, and he's going to show us the new Elisa's dock. This one is actually called the DM dock. Some of you guys are probably familiar with the old one, the IO dock. Um, and uh, what do we got new going with this? Yeah, so as you mentioned, we started with the IO dock last year, and it actually won the, the Editor's Choice Award by um, Electronic Musician Magazine. Yeah. Um, and now when we have the DM dock, we brought the, the iPad to the studio. Why not bring it to the drummers now? And what we have here is a sound, is a drum module that allows you to dock in your iPad so you actually get all your sounds from your iPad. With the power of the iPad, you'll be able to buy new sounds online. Uh, once you have your sounds, you can actually drag in, for example, a snare. You can drag a different crash. Maybe you get to your gig and you're going to be able to uh, download a new sound. Maybe you need a new snare sound while you're uh, in your gig. You can go ahead and buy a new sound. And everything is being controlled with the DM dock. In the back of it, you have all your CRS plug, uh, inputs for your um, for your actual pads and everything. So you can have up to up to actually 12 um, different triggers. So you can have your bass drum, so snare, and everything. So you yeah, you can plug in your triggers. Thing. Absolutely. Awesome. So if you already own one of our uh, drum sets. You can bring this, our drum sets are, or anybody's drum sets. You buy this and you can plug it into any electronic drum set. So this is going to drum set. The, the, the little uh, computer piece that comes with a lot of the... Exactly. The, the user that wants to have the expandability and is using this, they can leave the module at home and bring this one. Right. It's a whole different, wow. it's, a, it's a brand new drum module. Now does this also, is this only for drums or does it also work, uh, I guess it's DM so that would make sense. Correct? Yeah, it's DM. However, let's say if you have any anything that sends a MIDI signal, through a TRS cable, you can put it here. Of course, being uh, a drum, designed for drums, is going to be better to use with drums and everything. Uh, however, you have MIDI in and out here. Right. So in theory, you could have a keyboard to the side plugged into this and then triggers and everything. You, the, uh, you're what we want to put here is that you put the limitations. We give you all these tools and you, you limit yourself to whatever your creativity takes you to. Excellent. Can you tell, uh, let's just talk a bit, since we're standing here, a little yeah. bit about the IO dock, because it is relatively new. Um, tell us a little bit about it. The IO dock is actually one of my favorite products that we've released in the past few years. Uh, I'm an iPad user myself, so this one is close to my heart. You have an audio interface for your iPad. So first thing, you dock the iPad in, right? You have two Nutri uh, combo XLR quarter inch combo uh, inputs in the back. Phantom power, so you can actually do sessions with a condenser mic. You have phantom power. You have a foot switch control to whether start, stop, or recording. So you can be playing guitar and recording everything into GarageBand or any other uh, software, uh, music recording software uh, app on your on your iPad. And of course, we have video out as well. So if you're doing video control or stuff like that, I use my out dock in the studio. Sometimes I just plug the video out to my TV and watch movies. <laughs> so I mean, I use it for everything. Um, and I have my main outputs, of course, audio-wise headphone output on the side, and we also have MIDI in and out, and USB. So you can use it as an audio interface for your computer. You don't have to have the iPad. This could be running your main studio and your iPad if you want to. Excellent, I see you're, you're running the new uh, Moog uh, uh, iPad app here. Yeah, I actually use that one a lot. I, I have my studio set up, and I have my AirDog to the side, and I run that app, that app, the Moog app, and I love it. All the, I mean, the sounds that I can get out of it are pretty amazing. Pretty. And I get the sound quality output of the, of the IO dock. Well, excellent. Thank you very much, NAM 2012. Enjoy. Go check it out. The DM for the drums and the IO dock if you haven't picked that up already.